what's up y'all i got a family to feed so let's get into this tea we about to get into china insinuating that her mom wants to race krishan krishan what i want to say to you quick as god gave it to you baby god will snatch it if you don't do right how the hell you want to tell mommy she can't kiss her grandchild because that's her child huh if y'all hear snoring honey's house snore um because that's her child what are we talking about here? But this man carrying him that wearing blue nail polish and wearing nail polish on his fingers. What does nail polish have to do with saliva? <laughs> and and then she said carrying him. She didn't say kissing him, carrying him. So blue face daddy, which is the grandfather, can't carry him. Which I'm sure Krishan mom can, because she didn't say that. But kiss him? No. I, a, I don't know where your lips been. B, um, Girl, I don't know your lips, man. That's what I'm gonna leave it at. Like, come on now, stop it. So my mother, y'all, uh, my mother wanna run. My mother was always a track runner. That's where everybody get that running sh that came from my mother. Because when you are a child, you inherit your parents' traits. So mommy told me today, she said, Nika, I wanna race with Sean. She said she thinks she's so much better than me. Where she thinks she got it from, Nika? What? That's that's y'all so dysfunctional it's disgusting i'm not gonna lie mommy said i'm about to get myself together that's what my mother just told me and she said i want to race my daughter you gonna lose not in the <laughs> car because she said she don't you're not gonna lose because uh come on now <laughs> you're gonna lose. i want to hurt in the car she want to race her on feet i want to do ways though my mother would be able to win a couple of dollars after she went you want to know if she can win a couple dollars after she win. So you want Krishan to race her mom. Or you want your mom to race Krishan for money. Or Krishan mama want to race her for money. Y'all, what are we talking about here? No, like, seriously. What are we talking about here? She going ham. <laughs> what are we talking about here? Like, I, I don't, I don't understand the whole... I just want to take money from my daughter all the time. I feel like she's not giving you money for a reason. Um, <clears throat> and Krishan making a lot of money, but that don't mean she got to give her money to anybody. Um, she can give her money to who she wants to give it to because she's the one who uh, made this money. So, you know what I'm saying? It's a reason why she's not giving her mom money. And it's also a reason why she won't let her kiss her grandchild. Uh, she may be her grandchild, but she is... He is hers. <laughs> he came from her. So y'all let me know what y'all think about that down in the comment section below, girl, because I'm girl. Cameron CNN tonight interview about P. Diddy. And I just want y'all to know he could have stayed on his podcast. Being here. First, when you saw that video of... Diddy, Cassie, uh, in that hotel. Did you recognize that Sean Combs? Um, what I want to say, first of all, when I seen the video, um, everything in the video is egregious. I'm against. Uh, I don't support uh, all the charges that's alleged against him. I don't support any of that traffic and minors, uh, domestic violence. I'm totally against it. So when I seen the video, yeah, I was kind of upset with it. Uh, no, being that I know him, he's not necessarily a friend, but yeah, I was upset when I seen it. But did, did you recognize as as everything him? I just said? Did you recognize right, that I kind of anger at all from your experiences? I don't know him like that. What do you mean? Do I be recognized? Do I recognize him? I seen him. What do you mean? My experiences? I seen him and I. Uh. <laughs> Where is the PR team? <laughs> Who booked this interview? Cameron wasn't ready for it. He was real dip set on this on the CNN. <laughs> what you mean? Did I see it? What you, what you mean? I thought, I thought it was disgusting. I didn't do a zoom in to see if it was really him or nothing, but he admitted it was him. So, yeah, it was him. Nigga, it was him. Y'all stop with the, uh, this was an AI and all the other shit, or CGI or whatever. Nigga, that was him. I don't understand. 
What did you think about the apology that he gave in that other video? Ain't me for the, the apology ain't for me to decide for Cassie. What, what, I, what I think, one, one, one in the think chat. about it don't matter. He ain't do nothing to me. Cassie need to, need to ask Cassie if she accept the apology. I told you I feel. I said what I said. Why are you so damn defensive? <laughs> so aggressive. <laughs> what is the problem? She just asked the question that was on the monitor. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I want to play a conversation that you had on your podcast back in September with Mace. Mm -hmm. Listen. Yeah. When you had your mm, record that's... deal, why did you take me to Biggie Smalls and not um, Bad Boy? Man, it's almost going to bring me to tears to say this. I just, being that I saw you as, as such a good friend, I wanted to put you with somebody I knew with. Thank you, man. I really appreciate that. A lot of people ask me that on Instagram, yeah, I knew man. Don't oh, have me. That's why I'm here crying. I, I don't want to get emotional knew, in here, man. Instantly, I knew Biggie would, would do right by you. Can you tell us a little bit more about that? I mean, is there, um, is there something known in the industry about how Diddy treated his artists? Oh, it was a perfect time to take a drink, huh? So I'm going to get some cheeks after this horsepower joint. Cameron, you're on the way to 50. We know you getting some ass. <laughs> Cameron, we all getting some ass. <laughs> Why do we have to know you was getting some ass? <laughs> I'm so... Um, the black in her, I know when she was with her girls, when she got off work, girl, Cameron showed his ass on his interview today. I'm just going over what Mace said. Mace took me to Biggie. I don't really know Puff is like Mace no Puff. So I appreciate what Mace said. And of course, uh, that's my brother. So if he felt that way, then he felt that way. I can't really tell you how. Puff moves or anything like that. Mace may know better than me because he was signed to Puff. I wasn't. But my show does come on at 8 a.m. Eastern on YouTube. It's called It Is What It Is. Y'all y'all see her grin? She like this nigga just did a shameless plug. I'll make sure y'all check it out. I mean, I might get some more information out of Mace from there, but for me to tell you mm. how Puff acting and all that, I don't know. I never was signed to him. Yeah. What about the industry in general? I mean, so many people have pointed out that Diddy couldn't get away with this stuff if there weren't a lot of people protecting him. Do you think that's the case? Who the talent agent for this joint? Like, you think I'll be sitting around watching what Diddy do and all this? I didn't know this was a Diddy joint that I was invited me to. Yo, who, yo, who booked me for this joint? All right. Oh, wow, and I'll be sitting Cameron, around watching Diddy and all that? Yeah, thanks, man, come on, man. This thanks for crazy, joining man. us. Thank you for your time tonight. Yeah, yeah yo, thank, yo, thank you for having me. You enjoy it. Yeah, 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 yeah. You thank you for having me. You enjoy hearing this. <laughs> First of all, I don't know why he had to let us know that he was getting some cheeks. Like, you are definitely, you've been here for a long time. We know you getting some ass, okay? You actually been getting ass for a long time right so whatever horsepower you had to drink or whatever little pill you had to pop right quick or whatever line you had to snort okay <laughs> i don't i don't think we need to know all that okay that's number one number two uh why are you so defensive about the P. Diddy questions? Now, what I would have said was y'all booked this interview to ask me about Diddy the whole time. I mean, what's up? Talk about me. I got a podcast. I got this. I got that. There's so many ways he could have did that. I don't know why in the hell they would put him on TV. But what I will say is that's probably the last interview that CNN is going to give him. Okay. Now, I don't know if it was free or if they pay him a bag for this. 
but by far one of the worst interviews I've seen in a long time. He was so disgusted. <laughs> so disgusted. So, girl, y'all let me know what y'all think about this down in the comment section below. I think that um, he kind of was on some eye on. I don't want to do. I don't want none of this drama. I don't want to deal with none of this drama. I don't want to be put in none of this drama. Uh -uh. He don't want none of this drama. So. <laughs> That's kind of where I'm at with it, y'all. Let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. Check out my ebooks. Link will be in the uh, description. Make sure y'all tap into my Patreon. I react to copyrighted content over there. Um, and I'm just into a lot of different things. And y'all need to tap in because y'all don't know. Okay? Later.